Hey, how's it going guys? It's Nate here. And oh my god, do we not have some big news today. As this morning, Bethesda Game Studios' official Twitter handle tweeted out the following GIF with the hashtag, please stand by. Immediately afterward, they began an IRL Twitch livestream that simply showed off the Volt Tech Volt Boy standing in front of a computer monitor with the please stand by image on screen. The studio is teasing something big and something Fallout related. Now, keep in mind, as I make this video, that Twitch stream is still in fact live. It's still ongoing. Now, nothing seems to be happening, but it's still there, so if you want to check it out, now's your chance. Now, it's important to note that today, March 29th, 2018, is the exact three-year anniversary of when Bethesda began teasing Fallout 4 all the way back in 2015. Additionally, later this year will be the 10-year anniversary of Fallout 3's release. Fallout 3 is pretty significant, as it's the first Fallout game Bethesda developed after acquiring the license. So, this all gives us cause to wonder, what exactly is Bethesda teasing? Fallout 5? Fallout 3 Remastered, maybe? Perhaps a new Obsidian developed title? Well, from the looks at it, whatever Bethesda is hinting at isn't actually a remaster, or anything made with the help of Obsidian. As shortly after Bethesda posted this tweet, the internet obviously went nuts, and many people began to reach out to Obsidian's Twitter handle for more information. An Obsidian's Twitter account posted the following, saying, quote, How do you let someone down easily? Asking for a friend, hashtag, it's not us. Implying that Obsidian is not behind whatever it is Bethesda's tweeting about. Additionally, an admin on the website Reset Era, an online forum that's known for demanding considerable credentials from alleged leakers, who claims to have spoken with a Bethesda insider a while back, responded to a comment that suggested Bethesda's teasing is in relation to an upcoming remaster, with the simple word, Nope. Now, I cannot understate the reputation this website has built up in the community for strict administrators and not tolerating any sort of bogus leaks or trolling or anything of that sort. But according to the administrator, he spoke with a BGS insider who gave him considerable information regarding what the company has planned for this year's E3. And being an admin, I doubt he would lie about this. So personally, I do in fact believe him. Regardless, it's still not an official source, so do keep that in mind and feel free to have some doubt. Now, that said, if you do still have hope for a Fallout 3 remaster, there's still some reason to hold out. As earlier this year, another supposed leak surfaced of an image of Nintendo's planned E3 conference schedule. Listed here, among a variety of other things, was time dedicated to a presentation of something called Fallout 3 Anniversary, with gameplay and a trailer. Though again, this was also another unofficial leak that cannot be verified. So it's really up to you who you decide to believe. No matter what though, it seems very safe to assume that Bethesda Game Studios is in fact behind this upcoming title, as it was their official Twitter that posted this GIF that started all the hype, not Bethesda Softworks or another subsidiary developer. So whether it's a sequel or Fallout 5 or God forbid Battle Royale Fallout Edition, it's being developed by Bethesda Game Studios. The fact that Bethesda is gearing up for an upcoming Fallout release is absolutely shocking nonetheless. Previously, most, myself included, had expected the studio to be working on a space set game called Starfield, as Bethesda's parent company, ZeniMax Media, filed trademarks protecting such a name, and various leakers claimed that's what the company was up to. But this announcement came absolutely out of nowhere. Even if the studio wasn't working on Starfield, Bethesda's PR and marketing VP, Pete Hines, went on record saying the studio had at least two big games before they even developed the next Elder Scrolls title. Okay, so sorry folks. And just so you know, not at the next Gamescom, and not at the one after that, and the there are, at least, we'll keep asking. there are at least two <laughs> big games from Bethesda Game Studios before we get around to Elder Scrolls oh, okay. so many the And Bethesda has traditionally followed a pattern of releasing Fallout and Elder Scrolls games right after each other. So there was Oblivion, then Fallout 3, then Skyrim, then Fallout 4, you get the idea. So most had assumed that pattern would be maintained, but evidently not. Bethesda Game Studios seems to in fact be releasing two Fallout games in succession of each other. Now, some people have floated the idea that perhaps Bethesda Game Studios is actually going to announce two games at this year's E3, and whatever this Fallout title is only one of them. But that seems to be very unlikely, as chances are these two games would come out right around the same time and just end up competing with each other for attention and sales, which is absolutely horrible for business. It's unclear when exactly we'll get an official announcement or reveal confirming this new game's actual name and what it'll be about. Based upon what happened with Fallout 4, we'll likely have to wait until E3 on June 10th for any sort of trailer. 
For now, Bethesda is just trying to build up hype and get people excited. And my god, is it working. But with that, we're going to wrap up. Thanks for stopping by, everyone. What do you think this Fallout is? Fallout 5, perhaps? Maybe it is a remaster. Leave a comment down below. I would love to see a discussion with all of our crazy ideas and thoughts. But anyway, if you found this video useful or informative, like ratings are always very much appreciated, and I hope to catch you all in my next one. Peace out, everybody.